going on everybody welcome back to the channel i got a cool new build for you today check this out right here look at this it's an xbox 360. that's right i was at uh, target the other day i didn't know this existed i saw this sitting on the shelf we we're walking through electronics and i was like what the heck they're selling an xbox 360. so i pick it up and I'm, i look at it closer and i can see that it's a building block set this is by mega yeah, Mega Collector's Building Set. There you go. Right there. An Xbox 360. It's got the Halo 3 uh, game cartridge or game disc in it. it. Doesn't It's not real. It doesn't really work. It's got the, the controller there. Yeah, as you can see, it has the hard drive that you can take off. Check that out. Look at the back. So the side comes off and reveals the insides of it. And then if you put the disc in, Cortana comes on right here. Check that out. That is freaking cool, man. This set is for uh, 18 and up. You can see right there, 1,342 pieces. So the Xbox 360 is one of the most successful uh, gaming systems that ever came out. Uh, I, I believe it was X, uh, Microsoft's most successful gaming console uh, to date. And... Uh, I believe it actually beat PlayStation in that uh, in that uh, console. I, you know, I'm not positive about that, but I think so. Uh, it was one of my favorite systems. I loved it. I had uh, several of them, including the Star Wars version, which I kick myself every day for getting rid of. I wish I would have kept it. I had sold it off to somebody else who wanted one when I had upgraded, and I wish I would have kept it. You know how many things. Did you get rid of throughout time that you were like, man, I wish I'd have kept that? Is the uh, the Star Wars version of this that looked like R2-D2 with the C-3PO controller was just, <laughs> it was so cool, man. It had the sound effects and everything on it. Such a cool system. Uh, one day, maybe I'll try to get it back again. But anyways, guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and get up top and get this thing open. All right, here it is, guys on the top down camera, Xbox 360 Mega Collector building set. This is a three uh, fourth scale model. It's not a full size. It's like I said, three, three quarter size, three four size. Uh, again, 18 and up, 1,342 pizzas. Get a look at the side here, turn it this way. Yeah, so you build the console, the controller, you build the, uh, the storage drive there. Uh, and you build the uh, the case with the with the disc. Super cool. Let's look at the back here. Here you can see uh, you actually have Cortana here inside. And whenever you push the disc in, supposedly it uh, lights up, which is really neat too. I think other things like uh, like the light here, I believe, lights up on it. The the power button. Uh, really cool. It will be neat to display uh, if you're a fan of the Xbox 360. Uh, you would definitely be a fan of this. Having this is just a model to display. So, uh, all right, let's crack this thing open. Got the tape on it. Let's see what we got inside. All right, cool looking box on the inside too. Has all the Xbox swirls and everything. Kind of turned to the side. You can see uh, inside the top. Uh, also, you have the controller with all the directions on how to use the controller as if it was a real one uh, you have the uh, insides here of the xbox pretty cool looking we got all of our bricks here get these out yeah there are some light light bricks right here as you can see pretty neat let's get to the instruction manual i've never built a mega block set before but you know they look a, a lot like lego and that is a thick manual Go ahead and get rid of the box. Huh, nice. All right, let's get all this out of the way and take a quick look at the manual. Oh, check it out. Look, there's the, uh, the little uh, game box there. Got that classic Xbox green on it. All right, here's the manual. Let's take a look inside and see how the build looks like it's going to go. Okay, it looks like we have... Uh, Bags one through five are going to build the controller. Six through 23 plus A, B, and C are going to build the console. And then 24 and 25 are going to handle uh, the game and the game uh, box and the game container there. 
Okay. So it looks like we're going to start off by building the controller and get that out of the way. And yes, we have a lot of building. It looks like the instructions are very clear. I like that. And we'll be going all the way through to the end. Cool. Very cool. Got that Xbox green again on the pages. Uh, that's nice. You get just like a Lego, you get a diagram of all the different pieces in the back. As you can see. Cool, 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 man. All right, as a lot of you know, um, Lego did the, I believe, the Nintendo, the NES, and the uh, Atari 2600, which were very cool looking kits. I never built either one of them. Uh, but when I seen this, and I was, I seen that it was actually a building set, I was like, man, I got to get that. So it was uh, definitely one of my favorite consoles of all time. So let's go ahead and get started.
Hey guys, we are all done with the mega building set of the Xbox 360. Wow, this thing is cool. First, I'm going to show you uh, the first thing you get done building is the controller. So you build the controller first. Here it is. A nice up close shot there. Take it off its little stand. As you can see, you got your uh, ABXY buttons right there. They're all marked ABXY. You got your power button. Yeah, your back, your start. It's got everything on it. All the, the 
You got your joysticks here that actually will move. You got your D-pad right here. Uh, how cool, man. You got your uh, left and right buttons, your left and right trigger. You got your uh, different ports here. There's Microsoft on it in front and back for your headphones and your charging. It actually feels pretty decent in your hand. It's got the battery pack. You know, all of this is just bricks, of course. None of this is real. But it does have a light. It does light up if you push the power button. The controller does light up. Look at that. And just after a few seconds, it'll go back off again. Check that out. How cool is that, man? That's pretty neat. And of course, it comes with a little stand. Put it in. And it holds it just like that. That is cool, man. All right, and then you move on to actually building the console. And here's the console. So cool. It, I mean, it looks just like an Xbox 360. Like from a distance, you wouldn't know. Sitting somewhere by your TV, people would just see it and think that's an Xbox 360. It's even got your uh, your uh, hard drive on the top here. It's got the little feet. They're just, you know, plastic. They're hard plastic. They're not rubberized or anything. Looks like all the vents. There's the back. All your connections on the back with the vents. They even, like, are sunk in. How cool is that, man? And here's the other side. And then, of course, the front again. Now, what's super cool is there's not a single sticker on this. Everything that you see is all printed. All of it. It's all printed on there. You even get the chrome for the, uh, for the disk drive that pops out. It doesn't pop out on this, of course, but uh, it's got the power button. Got, got your memory slots here. It's got the IR right there. Check that out. It, it, this thing is so freaking cool. There's the bottom. It's got its feet on it, too. All right, now this has also has lights in it. It's got three different lights in it. It's got lights for the power button. Here's the power button. It lights up. As you can see there. And then it'll go off after a few seconds. All right. Now, you open this up. You can take the hard drive off. Pop it off right here. There we go. And it looks just like, just like the hard drive that you would get. And then right here, you got this little green switch. You pull on it, and it pops the side out. And then you want to take the side panel off. Comes off pretty easily. Now you start seeing the insides there. You see the disk drive there. Okay. Now we're going to take the middle panel off. All right. You start seeing more. And then we're going to take the bottom panel off. There we go. And now we have our internals. Yeah, all your wiring and tubing and your, your heat sink and everything here. Now, if you push this big Xbox button here, it lights up. And it pulsates. And then it'll go off. Then you get this little Easter egg right here. What happens is if when you put the disc in or just push down on it, it lights up Cortana. You got Cortana in there. And do it again. Look at that. How cool is that? That is freaking awesome, man. If you're a fan of uh, Halo, you're going to love that. Absolutely love it. A little fan spin. So you got three different points of lighting up on the console itself. And on the controller, you got one. After you get done building the console, uh, you build your game. You get, it comes with Halo 3. Of course, not the real game. But the case looks just like the original case. has all the artwork. It's got the description and everything of the game. Isn't that cool? Xbox green. When you open the case up, you got Halo 3 right there. Now, it's not, of course, it's not a real game disc, but it looks just like that. When you get this, it comes in this neat little paper envelope here. All right, so you can take the Halo disc and you can put it inside. So you push down on it and it lights up Cortana. Check that out. It actually goes down. Let me get it right. It's hard to do on the camera like this. There. You push it down. There's a little clip that'll hold it. And it'll stay in just like that. 
if you want to display it inside the machine you can when you're done with it you just put it right back in the little case just sits in just like that and then close it up look at that so freaking cool man and it's just you know it's three quarter size of an original and then to top it all off you get another little easter egg in this when you get done the very last thing you build is your achievement you unlock an achievement for build an xbox isn't that neat man it comes on a little it's got a little brick for a little stand there sits on it so you can display it right by your xbox how neat is that man i, I love it i love every bit of this I put the hard drive back on so yeah guys this was like a super fun build and it's very easy just to pop the panels right back on and display it that way or display it with the side panel off so you can see inside which is probably what i will do i will i will display it so you can see inside so cool man <laughs> this thing's awesome all right guys i hope you like this little cool build that i brought you today i had a lot of fun doing it i bought this it was 149 dollars so target i'm not sure if they have this on amazon or not i think this is an exclusively target product so i think that's the only place you can get it but uh, if they have it at amazon i'll leave a link down below uh, if they have it at target that you can buy online i will also leave a link down below for that but anyways guys i hope you liked the video make sure you like and subscribe it helps us out tremendously and i'll see you next time i'm Chewy solo and this is black and red builds see you. Now that is a whole lot of fun right there.